Greetings everyone and welcome back to Old World Blues in which we're playing as a very large realm of Diana. So, right now, let's go ahead and do my dominion where we left off in the last video. I've saved many of my children and freed many more innocents, but my work is not yet done. I can still hear the cries and pleas of those who still uh, under the thumb of oppression and death. It is enough for me to redouble my efforts. I have heard these sounds for centuries and it is time for me to put it to a stop. Hell hath no fury like a mother fighting for her child. Every Colorado State and owned by a neutral country. Claim gained by us. So, right now, we are still waiting. Actually, we can do a lot of this stuff here, too. What does that do? There's a flag there. Uh, we're waiting to go to War of the Graven's Coast. Syndicate councils. Ah, syndicate councils. Add infrastructure, manpower, logistics companies. Additional recruitable population factor. Very nice. And I do apologize for the last video in which I was a little bit of a... Grumpster will say fighting against some Cyclops folk, but hopefully this episode will go Perhaps a little bit more smoothly than the last but there are no guarantees in life except death and taxes But regardless, what are we looking for? Ah, aerial warfare, why not? We've yet to do that and we've got plenty of air XP Six research slots, we'll get the sixth one in the last episode, which is amazing Bellevue You know, I've never been to the Pacific Northwest Might never go but maybe, hopefully. We still have about a little less than 60 days left against Graven, which is totally fine. Especially since we have sent soldiers all the way east to Colorado, compared to Washington State. In which we are going to continue probably coring more territory. As much as I would like to do all those decisions that we have um, regarding like population increases in infrastructure... I think coring is pretty cool. So, co border conflict is over. Great news from the front, the border clashes over and we have won. Enemy forces can so seen, be seen retreating before our impressive show of force. We have successfully driven back the raider scum from our lands. Our people will s sleep safe for a while, knowing the might of our military is there to protect them if need be. Uh, I guess, yeah, we were in a battle. I didn't realize that. Okay, cool. Multivac, cool. And good work, lads. A bonus to land auction. And they lose political power. That's not bad. Gatling lasers, don't mind if we do. Alright, let's go ahead and core any sort of land that we possibly can. Eden. Uh, oh, we own Eden. Let's go and do Eden, because we've heard about that at least once or twice. Phoenix would be nice and core. Red Sun. Oh, yes. Careful Leaf is gone. Yeah. So, apparently, yeah. It, uh, the cap has now been lowered to 120 compared to 300 before before our modifiers. So, 120 political power to court, like, territories is just amazing. That's absolutely amazing. Now, we can do Rome. Oh, opportunity, because... The Navajo Nation has to exist. But it doesn't matter, since we have to go fight them anyway, so. My friend's resting place, we own Tlaloxer, Lost Contact. Cool, and City of Tomorrow. Very cool. Ooh, has national spirit, the soul of Odysseus. But we should do writing and constitution next. The final level is self-actualization, the full realization of one's potential. None of our citizens shall be held back, and we will restore the light of democracy and human rights to the wasteland, with no need to defend themselves or fend for their lives. All shall be able to become their best self, and never shall this constitution protecting them be trampled. Powerful industrial focuses. So, we can't go to war now, because we need to save time to write a constitution. Which is totally fine, totally cool. That gives us more time to build up more robots, which we discovered maybe we shouldn't make 40 combat with. Probably shouldn't. Still might make him 40 combat with though, but at least we understand that we... More about where we should send our soldiers. Let's go ahead and do this. Scoundrels vehicles. Restore the Nasui. Very cool. And do we have... Uh, investigate rumors. Let's do that again. Because last time we ended up with disappeared scouts. And... Oh, we have that much. And we have 8,000 caps. So that's not too bad. Ooh, advanced ballistic weaponry. Clear the ferals from Vault 6. Don't mind if we do. Clearing out the vault of the ghoul infestation that has plagued it for almost two centuries costs us more than a few members of the security team. However, Vault 6 seems to be perfectly intact and could be used as either a new settlement or as a production center. We could get more factories, but as we've established already throughout this campaign, I kind of prefer getting more manpower at this point. Uh, I don't want any more infantry. I really don't. As much as I really do like using them, we're kind of okay for now. And at this point, I'm going to go up to 18. That's going to cost us quite a bit more caps. That's kind of okay with me for now, because we need more armies, because to fight the NCR and the NCR Rangers and Urino, well, it's going to take some time. Natural disasters, we're not going to... Mm, we lose manpower stability, that's fine. Because we have enough stability anyways. So, uh, air, air base raids, cool. And we can go to war for Graven's Coast, hopefully soon enough. Hopefully we don't need to invade New Victoria or Heidi Confederation, but that is yet to be seen. Cool. Ah, the Nevada Pact is formed. Interesting. Very interesting. Uh, we'll, we'll, take, we'll take these guys out, hopefully, next. 
85 days is not bad. We're not going to go to war yet, though. We still have about two weeks before we can do that, which is totally fine. Totally, totally fine. All right, resource-wise, what do we have? We need more combat robots. Oh, my goodness. Our plane bombers. We'll get that in just a little bit. Go by 10. 10 and then... 10. Cool, why not? And actually, plane-wise, we can lower by that much. Cool. Next up, let's grab some more range. We don't really need to do any of this stuff, really. Uh, land doctrine, this stuff, naval warfare. Let's do naval warfare, because we will be we are making ships right now, actually. Nice. More robots. Half you guys go right here. Riding a constitution, time for war them. Write a codex of faith. National education program. Diana's voice nationwide. Central Tax Bureau. Wow, this stuff looks really great. Rethink Greenway's vision. Every unit later gets two more planning. Or two more logistics. Let's get logistics. Rebirth of the EPA. In the old world degeneracy that was the highest levels of American government academia, the Environmental Protection Agency and its efforts to preserve what remained were lights in the darkness. And in this grim and terrible world, it can and will once again be such a beacon with us leading the way. And we're going to do this one, but I do want you guys to check out this one as well. Rethinking Greenway's vision. Greenway's vision of, re of building a new society from the radioactive ashes of the old world was noble but not ambitious enough. With Diane at the helm, we will not only create a new society for people, but for all peoples of the wasteland. Our soldiers with this gold mine will be better prepared to fight any evildoers that would dare oppress innocents. Yeah, that's nice and all, but EPA, if I can do the EPA, I might do the EPA. And, let's see, who has more logistics, supply consumption? They're all pretty much exactly the same. 3222, 3222, 3222. Camera light, ooh, bruiser, no, that's okay. Finesse, eh. Enduring, eh. Lucky's not bad. Enduring, Charismatic is pretty good. Hot blooded, not that's okay. Fast shot, that's okay as well. Not great, not bad. I'm gonna go with All Spark and Inspirational as well. Inspirational and local leader. All right, let's go ahead and go to war and put these coast people down. Beautiful. Hopefully we can do well here. Of course, we're attacking over the river with. Robots, but we'll see what happens. Let's grab some cooling jackets. That'd be pretty good in my mind. Oh, we're not making stuff yet. Our plane bombers, nah. Oh, uh, uh we good. See, we're making some canoes here, so. Cool. Just in case, improve radar. Get the best radar. And of course, like normal, the NCR Rangers want to help us out. Actually, we do want to. Uh... You know what? Oh, Tohono Nation, we do want to take you out too. You know what? I'm not going to go to war with these guys yet. Let's do these guys first, and then, then we'll go to war with the NCR. Why? That is because if we take these guys out, the Nevada Pact, that means there's more land that we have to garrison, and we have a limited number of divisions, so we should maximize the areas where we can concentrate forces. Makes sense. Uh, scavenger Strength, that's mighty step into the future. Nice. Not bad. You guys, traders from Hawaii, if you'd like to read this. At the end of the last episode, I think this happened as well. So if you'd like to read, do go right ahead. But we're going to grab more political power if we can. And which we will terraform something around here. Guadalupe uh, Peak, El Mai Pias, Fort Summers, Drywell, Good Springs, Old Sun, Boulder City. Let's do Boulder City. That sounds like a fun place to core, right? Cool. So we're gonna put you guys. I mean, army here. Oh, actually, you know, I'll we'll put you guys right here. That would be good. A new growing army. So we need at least one, probably three strong armies around here. Probably the rest of the robots are right here, actually. Infantry can help defend this area, and infantry over down there, probably. It's not a guarantee of what we're doing. We should probably get advanced ballistic weaponry. That'd be pretty good. Oh, you're flooding through here, too. Oh, crap. Um, if that's the case... Oh, you guys are about to break over, aren't you? All right, then we got to do this. Infantry, you're doing a great job. We just can't afford to get it encircled right now. And part of the problem is that you guys weren't able to do your job, but that's all right. Lower tariffs? Sure, why not? That's fine. Gila? Why not? For birth of the EPA. Nation Diana's voice, a nationwide, although many methods of communication were lost or destroyed the during the Great War, many wastelanders still somehow have access to radios or devices that can pick up radio waves. To spread awareness of the twin mothers, I should create a radio station for Diana to reach out to those outside of our borders. I'm sure it's a novel idea. Nobody else has a radio station made exclusively for an AI, right? We can't get because we can. Let's grab some ballistic fibers. Cool. Let's go and go to war with these guys. I think that'd be quite okay. And they attack us, actually. Interesting. 
And now we attack them, and we shall bring them the f fists of justice. Wow, this is disgusting. Quite disgusting. Airbase raids, cool. Grab some dive bombing. Don't mind if we do. Come on, guys, keep moving. I'm not sure why you're pausing. You're not really pausing, but it seems like you are. These guys are going to take a while to take out, which is fine. Things take some time. Uh, can we get some other guys here or something here? What is this? We could raise the conscription level, but I think we're doing okay with our current levels. At least at the current moment. You Actually, uh, it's not bad. We've only killed off 8,500. It's still have 50 divisions, which is not good. Guys, guys, come on. Come on, please. Please move. Come on. Don't give me this crap that you cannot move. Please. We don't want a repeat of last episode. Just do what I ask. These robots are becoming more and more... Grinding my gears, I'll say. Grinding my gears. I don't understand why. Let me ask people to move. Please move. Good Springs. Good Springs next. Good Springs, good place. At least that's what I've been told. Simple tracks, why not? Where's the attack up here? Good, good, good. Alright, let's grab some more of this. How are you guys faring? Are you guys doing okay down here? Yeah, they seem to be. Just struggling a little bit. I'm going to have one guy hold the entire time. Because I, we can't afford to have these guys split up too much. Or unless we get in circle, because that's happened before, actually. Which really sucks. There you go, you're doing alright now. Alright, these guys are going to need some serious help, because they're just stupid. Oh, the generals, why? You're so dumb. <laughs> Hopefully we don't need to invade New Victoria. Please, for the love of God, I hope we don't have to invade New Victoria. You guys should easily be able to take these guys out. They should get no supplies. Introduction of greetings. Hello, boss's sister. Apprehensive acknowledgement of guilt. It's been a while. Meager explanation. Since my old boss's molten death, I've been on a quest of self-discovery. Traveling the world on my own little adventures. Friendly query. Have you ever been to Cuba? It's lovely this time of year. Puzzled query. Did he ever tell you? Did he never tell you about me? I worked for your brother, Odysseus. Dismissive request for a service. Regardless, I picked up a familiar signal that reminds me of him, so I figured I would travel down here and meet you here. Would you like to go visit the boss's grave with me? I would like that, yes. Oh. Hello, that's... I've never seen that before. Ooh, Odysseus project, huh? Hmm. Hmm. Oh, man, these guys are all cut off. I like that. Those guys died. Before we end it, though, we've only killed 11,500 off. 47 divisions. Yuma is ours. And Tohono Nation's gone. Beautiful. Where the dogs? Oh, we guys are killing each other. Oh, wait. We need to justify... No. Wow, it's a long time. Diana's voice, nationwide. Central Tax Bureau, as the old saying goes, the only thing that are certain in life are death and taxes, as we said earlier in this episode. The Twin Mothers doesn't ex explicitly promote death, but in order to promote the, promote the life and well-being of our citizens, we must levy reasonable taxes upon them in order to keep our administration and its programs relatively functional. Cool. I'm going to take you guys up here. Well, not take you guys. You guys are going to be expected to go up there. And do the best you can against Graven. Because he's flooding over here again. He's a Nikon poop. But it, he is what he is. Cool. Are you guys good? You're done? Nice. Get some more planes just in case. If, if we need more radar, we can make radar. We got a little bit of time here, especially since we have one army over here just kind of hanging out. Um, okay. Seems to be taking a while for these guys to die, but that's alright. 30 days, not bad. Let's get the other justification done first. It should be done very soon, but we do have a cup of coffee. Nice hot coffee here. Hmm. So the Wither Dogs are led by Old Dog. Oh, screw it. I'm, I'm, I'm done waiting. I thought we had... Oh, duh. I'm glad we... I'm done waiting, because that would, would have never happened, apparently. That's right. Level 8 attack. Or level skill level 8. That's not bad. Guys, please keep going. Please keep going. Robots. Robots, for the love of God, please do your duty. You guys, hanging down here. Come over here, help them out. 
You guys are down here. Just help out over here. I can't trust any of these robots. It's like they have a mind of their own. They don't want to do anything. Seriously, they literally don't want to do jack squat. Come on. Okay, please, just go. Care of an ambush? At least we can try. Just go. Please. Why are you not going anywhere? You're on... They're on an aggressive expansion, right? Am I, am I going blind? I might be. At the very least, can we at least take out these guys? Hmm... Uncourt states. Cool. Dive bombing. Oh, come on, game. Don't like this much, please. Please, please, please. Free from close air support. But at least we're making an army relatively quickly, which is kind of nice. And they cut us off. Because these soldiers refuse to move. I, I, I've said this before, and I will say this every single time until there's an option to Hoi 4. I don't care about supply issues. Like, I know I should, but if I tell the guys to move, like, even if they have supply issues, I don't care. Just move anyways. Force the order. But anyways, it is under Diana's wa watchful and caring eyes that have, we have been saved. And it's because of her guidance that we have been able to prosper in the face of adversity and despair. It is time that we create a con compendium of our deeds and of how we mes may best show our appreciation for her as her devoted children. Good. But yeah, like, you see those uh, little exclamation marks? That just tells you that, hey, we don't think supply is good here. But in my mind, that's just telling me I don't care. Like, I don't care. Just move. Seriously, just go. People are relying on you here. I'm pretty sure I set this up before, but whatever. Just go, 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 go. Advanced radar. Cool. We're done with that screen now. Industry, we are not done yet, but we will eventually be done soon. And you guys... I don't want supply issues up here, so we got to be careful. I'm really disappointed in Doki Doki. Like, I don't understand why they won't keep moving. Like, just go. Like, I get it that there's arrows here, but most of them are green, and they're not attacking enemy territory. I don't like that. I really don't like that. Yeah, special forces kit, because we can. More robots. Good. Investigate rumors again. My goodness, that takes forever. Come on, they're not even halfway to capitulating. This is, this is why I don't like to get the Northwest. It can be very annoying, too, sometimes. Prince George. Well... You're not gonna hold that for too long, George. Stop, stop. Just take just take him out. Come on, man. Cool, and that place. Game, game, come on. Oh my goodness, we need way more robots. Now we good. Nah, we good. Combat robots need way more. Uh how many light robots are we actually making? I bots now we're doing okay on. Go up by 10, go up by 10, and go up by another 10. Simple track school. We can get some savage cards next. Salvage cards, I should really say. Building a lot of stuff up, which is looking pretty good, but... Uh, I bought... Oh, wait. Oh, down here. Right, Codex of Faith? How about Robotic Citizenship Act? The minds of artificial intelligence and autonomous robots are just as capable, if not more so, than the, those of humans, but very few societies past and present have recognized the disparity in rights between man and machine. It's time we pass some legislation that rectifies this issue. Cool. The age of the machine. Alright, so it looks like we've, we've gotten rid of a, quite a few bad stuff around here, which is good. Which is very good. So I'm going to have you guys... 24 divisions stay right there. That's actually be a pretty strong group. Uh, for now, we'll, re we'll rectify this once we're done here. Actually, just in case. Ooh, don't tell me we can or cannot do this. New Victoria is our goddamn capital. Oh, Lord, no. It looks like we can, which is good. It's good. How many ships do we have? 125? That's not enough. Wow. And of course, like normal, this is all still messed up, so... C-cube droid? I don't remember putting C-cube droid on, but okay. That's a lot of ships. <laughs> Let's burn some naval module stuff? Yeah, why not? More organization would be good. 13 days, not bad. Free from close air support. Let's grab some more ground support. I hope to God that they don't have a massive navy. 
Because we have a lot of ships. They have, oh god, they have a big old navy. That's, oh man. Now I'm going to do this too. Oh boy. Two. Uh, just in case. Do it over the water, and we'll grab one, two, three, four, and three guys over here. There we go. Mm, more damage, why not? Discharging ammunition. Cool. Over here. Let's grab no power armor. And uh, not land it, not attack yet. Let's grab some scrap gun trucks, because we can. Hopefully, oh yeah, we lost a few planes, but they lost a ship, which is good. Lost a few more planes, but they lost some more ships. We'll get there. Oh, let's do this one too. Why not? Some more ships. Yep, they go bye bye. <clears throat> National education program. Nations of old prioritize the education of their younger generation so that once their forefathers pass them with the reins, they'd be ready to lend the, lead the way into the new age. We must educate our youth in Diana's ways and teaching so that when we pass, they will be able to carry on our work of restoring the land. Awesome. She was still making quite a few ships at the same time, so. Okay, how many... Oh my god, stop with the playing stuff, please. Yeah, like I said in the last video, I, I wish there was a way we could get rid of that. I'm not sure where you are. Up the coast, I don't think we can really connect with you, so... Nice, we're slowly destroying their navy, which is great. Great, 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 great. Wow, we can suck the part of their fleet. Wow, that, that's an actual battleship. Whoa. That's an actual battleship. Personal floating palace. Nice job, guys. Very nice job. Kill them off here, though. Um, doesn't matter. Go and do that. Please don't tell me we have to invade. We might not have to, but it, it's probably worth invading. If you guys are like this, and we already have the other group set up to invade, come on down here and I'll set you down south, probably. We're actually doing a pretty good job destroying a lot of enemy ships. I say that, and then we lose planes and nothing, gain nothing else. Just in case. Throw some air bases right there. We got the construction for it. Throw some more radar. There you go. Good stuff, good stuff. Cool. Like I said before, research doesn't really n matter nearly as much as it did early game, so. Special forces, but I do like the advanced land night attack bonus, which is very good. Uh, you guys go right there, I suppose. You guys, head on down south, actually, when you're done. Just come hang out down here. You might be able to do okay. And we'll have to build up some forts before we go to war, too, so. National Education Program, very cool. So we're done with this side. Ooh, we want to do this, but a pretty bad virus has resurfaced. Ooh, we might not be able to do that eventually. Eh, yeah, seems okay. What else is there in this focus tree? Ah, family law. So some of our scouts have found a nearby pre-war facility that Argos claims Gay Greenway had connections to before he departed, but seeing as the place in question is nothing more than a blackened crater, facility may be too generous of a term, however, there's always more than meets the naked eye. Yes, especially that eye is naked. Wow, that's a lot more divisions we have. Time for a new general. How about that? Aurora? More attack, and survivalist. Actually, survivalist. Why did I choose survivalist? I was not thinking of that one. Oof. Come on down here and hang out there for now. You guys can train. You all... Do I dare even risk trying to jump in the water? Wow, we lost so many planes there. But we killed quite a few enemy ships. That was actually probably pretty worth it, actually. Please get all the way over here. That'd be good. And you guys are active infantry. Infantry is reliable. Sometimes. <laughs> Definitely sometimes. How many more ships does the Graven Coast have? I would say not that much more. I think we do have the capabilities of potentially going down already and uh, trying to naval invade, maybe? Go ahead and go here. Good luck, guys. You're going to need it. I don't like naval invading, but hey, if we can do it, we can do it then. Nice. More divisions. Hopefully, for the love of God, we do okay here. Okay, we took the capital. That was probably one of the easiest times I've ever naval invaded this group before. 
Not bad. Thank you. Uh, where is this group? You're right here. Cool. Keep going. You're doing a great job. Oh, yeah, I forgot I invaded over here, too. Nice. Close the patrols. Let's grab some of this. More max speed. Very nice. And, hey, okay! That was a lot easier. I'm glad I naval invaded. Yeah, I actually feel pretty good about that. I hope you guys feel good about that as well, but all you have to do is just bomb the living hell out of the enemy navy, and you can do okay. Manpower? Um, well, I mean, I guess. Why not? With that in mind, I don't think we need a navy anymore, so I'm going to say bye-bye. Thank you for the manpower back. Because I don't want to waste resources on these guys. Because we don't really need this. That's really the only nation for now until Cuba is introduced into the game. Which will be far, far off when this video goes up. So, just let y'all know. Hmm. Here's what we're going to do. Uh, actually, all robots together. Monkey strong together. Or whatever the saying was. Here's what we're going to do. These five... They're going to be what I'm going to call, not the dream team, but hopefully good enough to hold the line and push into the Desert Rangers team. Because we're going we're gonna, to we're gonna make more divisions coming over here. Because you guys are all going to guard right here. Obviously, it's going to cost more men and more robots, but with 10,000 caps and restoring dugway proving grounds, scavenging the vehicles, almost 400 political power. We can go and do this. We can invest in more stimulus. We get 400 every month. And once we take out the NCR, it won't be that bad. Oh, a molten crate. I, it's so, there's so much here. We can't even see the bottom of this. With the guidance of the faithful Argos scouts and robots serving the tribe have been sent deep into the chasms of a facility out to the west of which Argos has been has stated a connection to the Greenway's past. The whole facility, once a grand monument to pre-war engineering, is now a twisting, burned-out crater. Through derelict terminals, data recovery, and the count of Argos, the scouts were able to paint a picture as to what happened here. The facility Tibbetts Prison was, in the heyday, a cold, sterile, steel-walled, automated prison facility run by the technology so ancient it dates back to the years before the Great War. Nearly 200 years ago, it was a facility designed to hold and protect some of the world's most dangerous criminals, and military and otherwise, before the war. Tibbetts Prison has its roots dating back to at least the 19th century. In 2040s, Tibbetts served an important role in the development of Vault Program. Before the Federal Vault Program was privatized and was known as a Federal Safe House Project, Tibbetts was used to test whether man could survive in isolation for extended t periods of time, something that was necessary to learn to understand the feasibility of whether the Safe House Project would or could work. Originally in the Federal Safe House Project, all the vaults would have been orchestrated and managed by a singular overseer artificial intelligence known as Ulysses, an AI developed by a contractor, a company known as Greenway Hydroponics. This would change after the Safe House Project was privatized and newly made vault tech feeling that there wasn't as much need for a managerial government-funded AI to oversee their private vault program instead. The board felt that the select individuals could serve the role of overseer instead, a split leadership system more likely to survive the apocalypse than a single-headed administration. With the Ulysses Project dead in the water, Greenway Hydroponics was forced to cut a deal and sell what research they had to the government. One half of the Ulysses research would be sent down to Mexico City to aid in the development of another managerial AI, while the other half was renamed to Odysseus and sent to Tibbetts Prison to serve as an AI to help assist in the newly spreading new plague, infecting citizens taken to quarantine inside of the prison's walls. Oh no. Over time and under the management of Odysseus, the prison became more advanced, utilizing robotics, wardens, and utility robots to maintain the structure, especially as war with China in the 2070s, and the annexation in Canada began to drain personnel from the U.S. All that changed with the end of the world. Uh, um, can, can I select something? I, I, oh, there it is. Okay, woo. A hope in the ash. Oh my gosh, another page. And the new world brought on by the great war Odysseus for some time was able to continue as it had in the decades prior, fiddling away as it sent out robots to hunt down those infected by the plague. With the death of every living member of the prison eventually, as a result of the chain of command took on every responsibility and title within the prison, became warden, judge, and jury. Having to take on this many responsibilities would lead to the AI developing a bit of a split personality within its computer core. Thankfully, nothing as catastrophic as would later develop in its twin in Mexico City, if only because managing a prison was less stressful than managing the entirety of pre-war Mexico. It wasn't until the late 2240s that serious problems began to occur for the Tibbetts prison system in Odysseus. Recovered terminal logs would point to several hundred occurrences of the Limit 115 being reported through the entirety of the greater Colorado and Arizona area. It is worth noting that while the Twin Mothers and local nearby settler groups which had some issues with the plague in this time period, it is nothing like what is being reported in those logs. Area 15... 
115. Isn't that the material used in, like, Nazi zombies? It seems that Odysseus was either tricked or had some sort of malfunction in regards to determining the severity of the new plague outbreaks across the wasteland. As a last-ditch effort to, or attempt to try to remedy the situation, it attempted to house as many infected citizens as it could before forcefully melting down its own computer core and thus the entire facility with it. This is why Tibbetts is how it is now, a burned-out creator in the earth. Through weeks of study we have, however, found in an automated backup that Odysseus recorded of its computer core in the 2020s. Oh! If we were to find a suitable unit to upload this into, we could potentially try to bring a limited version of it back online once again, brother. We had get the soul of Odysseus more research speed. Oh, boy. The City of Tomorrow. Ooh, TT the Dome. TTM the Dome desk. And I did forget about this. My apologies. I forgot about these guys completely, which is not very bueno of me. So actually, before we go to war with uh, those guys in the east against these folks... We're gonna have everyone here trained if we can. Wood treatment, that's totally fine with me. Doesn't matter too much. Grappling hooks, I guess. Doesn't really matter. I'll have everyone here trained as well. Cause let's go ahead and start coring some more stuff. And if we get more divisions for Lupton, Lupton, nice. Cause we'll use those soldiers immediately to Ooh, economic resurgence. Do what we must, we'll say like that. Uh doesn't I, I really don't care where we core at this point anymore. We're doing so well anyways, so. Well, I say that, and then we're going to struggle some more, probably. Uh, I'm researching this stuff. We don't really need this, though. Droids of Diana, you, thank you. More sand. I hate sand. It's coarse, and it gets everywhere. Mm. So with this campaign, I'm pretty sure we'll have one more episode after this, just because it's going to take some while to cut Colorado. It's going to take some time to cut New Reno and the NCR, but especially the yellow and green Mexico. Yucky, yuck. You know, they are killing each other, actually. That's good. And that is a bit yucky, yucky. Uh, better drills, more resource efficiency gain, invest into the military academy, eh, maybe, you know, we got the caps for it, let's do it anyways, just because I want to get more army XP, so that we can get advanced rifles, space survey, okay, oh, last time we had plus eight, we actually got the three percent chance, let's do it again, deep space survey, how do we do that, aerial warfare doctrine technology, future air force, okay, that costs quite a bit, 3% chance to get plus 40, 40% chance to get plus 10. Oh, okay, S simulation training. Ah, the city of tomorrow. As Diana's robotic scouts approach the city of Boulder, they would spot a shadow that had engulfed the city, a large futuristic sphere standing down a cliff, towering above it like a colossus. When Diana learned of, the, of this, she knew exactly what it was. It was Boulder Dome. Boulder, before the Great War, was a long was long a place where the advanced scientific research took place. Supported mostly by money from Denver's industry and an active military presence, Boulder scientists made advances in medicine, biome gels, vendor, alternate energy sources, robotics, and even developed a power armor uh, prototype. Construction of the research drone was not considered until the nearby Rocky Mountain arsenal had leakage of toxic waste, creating a poisonous cloud that swept through the Denver, killing many. In reaction, the military funded a program to create a self-sustaining research dome, making it resistant to a nuclear attack, and having the primary research inside be dedicated to the new plague. This city of the future was to be a prototype for settlements on the moon and other planets. Then the war with China began. Boulder became a hotbed of political activity, as most of the scientists were naturally suspicious of the military. When reports of plague outbreaks in Denver surfaced, many in Boulder feared that an exodus from the city would come here and infect them. They fled north, the scientists staying in a cold sleep stasis deep within the dome when the war started and bombs were flying. Flying. Cheyenne Mountain, a military facility home of NORAD, was a primary target. A huge section of the mountains became a great radioactive smoldering crater. Coupled with attacks on Denver and the Rocky Mountain Arsenal, Boulder was involuntarily included in a triangle of hellish death, yet over 170 years later, the dome still stands. It seems that in the interim, the seals keeping the hazardous materials within the dome have broken. Within a several mile radius around the city, there being no living thing besides those creatures resistant to radiation such as ghouls. What happened here to cause the city tomorrow to start to fall apart? This place used to be so promising. It didn't take long to discover what had happened. It was all Presper's fault. Victor Presper, before the Great War, was a revolutionary for his time. A United States citizen who, in the 2040s, worked on designs that would eventually lead to the Zach's artificial intelligence. When Diana was working uh, as a scientist, she had, at the times, had chances to work with, in tandem with Presper as a colleague, but he was infuriating to Diana. He showed up and he knew everything. Every new discovery she chanced on, he knew it better. Every novel idea she had, she had... 
she had was a childish thought to him. It turns out that one of the scientists who had frozen themselves in time in Boulder was none other than Presper, the scientist. In his usual frustrating ways, used the on-site code conditional protocol to win the influence of the other frozen scientists at the base. Treasure finders who tried to break into the dome and anyone else he could try to find in order to build himself an army. There would be no more frozen scientists by the time Diana arrived. Presper either having been indoctrinated, killed, or used them as experiments before taking everyone loyal and leaving for God knows where. Through the robotic scout's eyes, Diana could recognize the familiar faces with bullet holes lodged into the front of their skulls. It would be nerve-wracking if Diana had still had a nervous system. The only movement Diana's scouts could see within the city of tomorrow was stumbling, track-led Big Mountain Company trauma suits. Bodies still forced into locomotion through the suits on board motors. Still, there's at least one soul left within Boulder to meet. Or Boulder Dome to meet. The idle whirl of a familiar machine close by, if I only had arrived a few years earlier. In the deepest chamber of the city, Diana, Diana finally found another soul. It was a machine like the twin Zaxa that aided Diana's mind. This one stood alone, a low whirl emanating from its cooling unit. It never ran out of power, never had a critical failure, it simply ran out of memory. It seems that at some point in the post-war period, it had gotten itself into some sort of loop in regards to something called the Great Calculation. Attempting to solve this mystery caused it to lose all of its mem memory rapidly. It lost itself in self-actualized quandary until all that lingered in its mind were idle out-of-memory requests, pulling all cords that were true there. All a slow blindness that gradually completely blanketed it. If the Boulder scientists had been around to help, they could have probably kept this from happening. But now the Boulder's axe has gone silent. There is nothing that could be done. The Great Calculation had engulfed its mind so fully that it could took up the entirety of its memory. To remove it would involve clearing the Zax's mind fully. Diana reasonably had two choices she could do. She could attempt to reboot the Zax, purge its memory, and bring it back to the nursery to act as a third computational agent alongside with twin Zax she's already had. Or alternatively, she could wipe the Zack's memory and place the Odysseus back up within it, allowing the memory of her older brother to take over the machine. It would be a little nice to have family to talk to. My brother's gone. I need this Zax more than him. Bring it back to the nursery. Improve Diana's computational powers. The trifecta. I miss my brother. I don't want to be alone anymore. Install the soul of Odysseus back into the boulder Zax, hopefully bringing Odysseus back to the waking world. We remove the soul of Odysseus, the Greenway family together again. I've got to go with family. I've got to go with family. If I ever play Diana again, which I will, if we do this again as well, please remind me, go with my brother's gone. I need the Zax more than him, but we've got to go get my brother back. The Greenway family together again. With this short installation, we would, be, would begin the effort to install the Odysseus backup we found at the ruins of Tibbets into the mainframe of the Boulder Zax. At first, Odysseus was like a child, starting small as it expanded outwards into all directions within its digital space, trying to find what its boundaries were. It took some time before the old AI, bound in a newer shell, was able to speak in turn. It and Diana would share some words, privately, private banter between two siblings who had spent far too long separated. It was a lovely moment. I'm going to enjoy having a family to talk to, as will I. Oh, country changes to Odysseus. Oh, oh, what the heck? Um. Oh, we actually liberated Odysseus. Okay. They're my puppet. I can. We can play as them. Uh, do you have a? You have a unique book. Oh my god. It's 2288, and now we're just getting this. Um, I hope, I hope this doesn't try to kill me later on. I really hope it doesn't kill me later on. I was not expecting this at all. Holy cow. I'm going to deploy you early, because I want, I want to go to war now. Uh, go and do that. Come over here. Be led by, I wish Odysseus, but Domino is fine. Come over here and take these guys out, too. There we go. I want to finish off Colorado quickly. Forty days is fine, and that's actually really cool. Hopefully, he stays somewhat civil, but harder, better, stronger, faster. Now that we've made sure the twin mother's tribe is healthy and strong, we can use our robotics knowledge to go beyond the human form. Volunteers will be given capabilities beyond their even wildest dreams while we experiment with the next step in human evolution: cybernetics. Awesome. That's actually really cool that we have a little brother, we'll say, with us. Cool, both of you. Awesome. There you go. Advanced scouting kits? Why not? Why not? Like the Pokemon. Death Claws ate some of our team? Well, that's really disappointing. There you go. Boom, 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 boom. Boom, boom. There you go. And there you go. That should be good enough. And you guys... Actually, I sent it all to the wrong group, maybe. Oh, no. You, oh, yeah, I did send it to all the wrong group. Raiding Flotillas, that's fine. 
aggressive maneuvers, why not? Cool. Boom. 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 Thank you. Impact bumpers, very good. Let's grab some rubber refinement. That'd be very nice as well. And then we can go... Boom, boom. Boom, 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 boom. Duplicate it again, and there you go. Nice and easy, right? Hey, let's hope so. Grappling harpoons, not bad. Grab some more of this. Good. Hello, hello. And here we will uh, go. Oh man, hopefully we can win. What if we, wow, that's a lot of, look at that. That's a lot of command power. Daily gain 1.78, not bad. Better, harder, harder, better, faster, stronger. Nice. I like it like that. Come fly with me with the acquisition of such a wild satellite network and the wealth of information each contains. We were able to study pre-war aerial as well as spatial capabilities. And while we will never quite be able to launch our own little objects into orbit, yeah, we could put it to use on more advanced aeronautical military asset designs. Very cool. Domino, what do you got for us? Commando, I guess ninja. Uh, power armor, we don't have that. Go rooted then. Sure, guys, sure. Why not? New Sterling? Don't mind if we do. We've lost 22, and they've lost 2,000. And New Sterling's been completely cut off, and now... Okay, it's gone. Nice. As it should be. Oh, New Sterling is a thing, too. Puppet Ledger? Oh, yeah, we have a puppet now. The Penitentiary. Why not? And you guys are learning as well, which is just great, great, great. Which is fine, we got pl plenty of time. Escape slaves. Freedom is a right of every wastelander. Exploration for technology. Thank you, Iron Alliance. Thank you for playing. Cool. Thank you very much, guys. Oh, man, there's some serious lag there. Please don't crash. Oh, crap! There goes Mexico. No wonder that took a while. We got about a month left for that, which is fine. Oh, Mo Moctezuma actually won. I thought they wouldn't win. Holy cow. How is the Vice Royalty still alive? Which means they're going to attack us next, probably, because they might have claims on our territory. Maybe. Maybe. Wow. How's Odysseus doing? Production sentries? Uh, sure, why not? Naval spearhead, whatever. Let's grab some of this, too. That'd be nice. Economic Resurgence, very good, very good. Wow, that is some extreme lag. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. No wonder you weren't, weren't winning earlier, Doki Doki. Maybe that was my bad. Maybe I should have looked and given you more stuff. But whatever. Are we done with focuses? We might be. Be finally done with focuses. No, we're not. No, we're not. Found it. Uh, reflective per perfection. Our research into advanced special forces armor and association with association doctrines could be further put to use in the creation of power armor technology. Already, our special forces kit reaches almost pre-war level. With some modification, we can integrate mobility elements into its shell, creating a template for future research. Nice. Got some more land out attack. Oh, we can go to... Oh, nice. Go ahead, guys. Cool, cool, cool. After that, I might just go to War of the Bayou Mortars. Just... Uh, well, maybe not. I think it's best if we go to War of these guys next, then. They have the She with them, too, huh? Just so that we're somewhat ready. Come on, get Scott's Bluff. Very cool. No, oh, we just killed them all off before they could do anything else. Beautiful. You should be able to win pretty easily. Domino, level 4, not bad. Yeah, that's not really worth doing, though, since we're using just robots, so... And since we're here... So many planes, I love it. Nice. Throw them all right there. Every single one of them. You have so many planes, it's gonna be glorious. 
and then do some of that right there. Infrastructure prioritization. Got all allies in. Production handies? Oh yeah, we're gonna take some time with this, that's fine. Sure guys, yeah, why not? Space survey, we could do that, but nah. Oh, they, oh that, they died fast. They died really, really fast. Holy cow. Thank you very much. Disappointing we don't have boulder anymore, but whatever. Beautiful. Aw oh, yeah, more manpower. Alright, next up. Uh, more stimulus? Why not? Subsidize them? Hmm. Sure. How much money do we have? Oh, we got plenty. Okay, so now, we have you guys doing all that stuff up there. That's fine. We have you guys, which kind of screwed things up here. You are going to come over here, then. You guys were all like, yay. And we've we got this covered, so we need you to do, like, yay. Yay. Core stuff. Because now, we're going to need another additional army down here. Um, Just to play them early. Wow, 60 political power. Killer. Actually, do we get another one? Oh, yeah. Hecate. Oh, I forgot. Oh, my gosh. She is... Skill. She, she needs a P and an E in her name. We have Argos. Oh, my goodness. Argos. I gotta go with Mesmerize. Oh, we gotta go with Hecate. I gotta go with her. I just have to. Ninja, Life Giver. Experience Soldier Losses. Why not? I know she does upgrades, but whatever. All right, so... One, two, three, four... These guys should be able to hold. We should be able to do this. Two, three, four. But at least the Pacific Northwest is done, which is really nice, actually. And yes, it is pause. I finally paused the game. I know. Kind of radical for me. One, two, three. I hope this is enough divisions to hold down here. One, two, three. Everyone, you're ready? Train. Train, because good lord, we're going to need training. Uh, go ahead and let them go on them. We should get the justification done very, very soon. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. Yeah, boom. There we go. That's a lot of planes. That is 1,600 planes. Nice. Awesome. Rubber refinement as well. Oh, look at this. We almost maxed out, except for naval vessels and power armor and vehicles. Cool. Very cool. Anything else here? Nope. Anything else here? Explosive bows. Nice. Very cool. If you guys need to train, please train, train, train. As well as... Build up some forts around here, because we're probably going to need them. For the love of God, I hope we can hold out here. Do that anyways. Uh, just in case. Level one forts across the entire line against the NCR because they've had so much time to build up. They did not even fight the Legion. We fought the Legion. So, hope we can do well. Yeah, get some air bases down here. Get multiple air bases just in case we lose some territory. That'll be good. Give us some more time. That'll be great, great, great. You guys looking pretty good yourselves. I guess no one needs to train. Of course, we only have 2240 combat with divisions, but that's fine. Whatever. Uh, we're losing quite a bit of money, actually. Well, we're not losing money, but... God, it's a lot to do this. Production boost? Ooh, factory output? We don't really need that, though, which is totally fine. Let's grab some of this. Layered air zones. We can go to war for Hopeville right now if we really, really, really wanted to, but I'm thinking... Maybe we wait. Actually, when can we do space stuff? Man. Just need to research more. Just research a little bit more. Scavenge vehicles, sure. Restore the saps up. Moctezuma's Fire Wars. Rally the army. I don't really care. If we lose, whatever. I really don't care at this point. Investigate rumors again. Help all these guys. That'd be good. Uh, water, research speed. Eh. Only just two. Exploit it. Yes, we won't probably clamp down on autonomy. I, I can't be bothered to care. If lost, we lose 100 political power. God dang, that sucks. Suicide runs. I'd rather core stuff. Wigwam! Thank you. Uh, nice. Keep doing that because we can. Alright. 
Are we... We're not even close, I bet, to finish... Yeah, we're barely started this stuff. Salvage APC. Just let time go on for now. We will go to war before the war justification is done, though. By April 2nd, which we got plenty enough time. 3.38 political power day. Mm, is that really enough? Probably not. This will probably be the second biggest war we have to fight. So how strong are these guys? They have no fleet, which makes sense. They're almost out of manpower, so the NCR Rangers should be pretty easy to take out, even though they have a big number of planes. 153 divisions, quarter million manpower, holy cow, and then we got the big old she with no manpower either, with a few divisions. Dr. Sh... Dang, hello. Do the political workhorse, don't mind if I do. But, uh, non-tological bombing? Nice. Not bad. Not bad at all. Thermal vision devices? Let's grab some of this. Stealth boys. Won't help us at all, but whatever. We'll do it anyways. And there goes all that manpower. Or that army XP, I should really say. You guys... Oh, they're almost done. They're almost done. Three. Two. Ooh. Oh, we can still trade with Odysseus, of course. That makes sense. One. Go and go to war. It's probably a really bad idea. Are they attacking us anywhere? Well, let's let time go on first. N yep, there goes a she. I need the Desert Rangers in. There we go. The holds of robots shall deliver Diana a victory. Let's get some planning, actually. I'm... No. No, no, no. Let's make a, a defensive line. Hold, everyone. Hold, hold, hold. Hold your butts. I... <sighs> hold! What, what are you doing? Uh, this is the. You see this? I made one massive defensive line and they're still moving around? Why? I swear I will never know. I want to give you more planning, but these guys are big dum dums. Let's do some pre war infantry kits. Three, two, please go. Please clap. Well, oh my goodness. As soon as we began the war, so much is going on. Look at that. 3.61, 31. We got four a day. Oh, it's so nice. Common weaponry. Yeah, buddy. He has some good stuff right there. Hopefully enough for combat robots. Casualties. Kicked 6,000. We're taking 106 for now. Uh, there's guys down there. If these guys are not going to do anything, I guess... I guess we're good to attack across the entire line. I'm not sure why they're not doing anything, or why they're so weak right now. We've only killed 9,000, but... You know, I guess it's probably because we have air superiority. Unorthodox interception routes. Nice. That's what I'm going to assume. Over here, we're not doing that well. So, they have a lot of planes themselves, but, like, here, we're doing very, very well. Can I tell Doki Doki to just force the attack and just kill them all? That'd be kind of nice. 100, well. This is going a lot easier, so much easier than I thought. If that's the case, well, destruction of Ranger Citadel. Might as well get started with that, right? This is looking kind of disgusting, not gonna lie. Alright, so you, y'all come here and focus on that stuff. Cool, that's all you need. And then you guys, Hecate, I'm glad you're with us, Hecate. Well, you've missed you, Hecate. Where are you guys? Oh, you guys are up there. Uh, actually, I don't need to do that up there anymore. Come down here. Take out Baja, California. Go all the way down to the tip. Which looks very weird. It's like a butt tip. You got like, you got like a, a cheek here, and then a cheek here. It's very diff it's very weird cheek, but I don't know why I'm thinking of cheeks right now. Whatever. Don't ask me. Uh, Lamar Garrison? Yes. Go. Oh, man. This looks really bad for y'all. NCR Rangers about to capitulate. Hopefully. This is... This is... Hmm. Well, then. I guess we have to focus down south very soon. How... Oh, how... Oh, oh. You know what? Thank you, Moctezuma. You're saving us so much time, Moctezuma. Oh my god, ten days. Uh, they're about ready to kill, gonna kill us off. That's not good. Oh man. I didn't... Oh, I hope we would not have a time limit for this, but okay. Um, Keep going, guys. Pandora's box, thankfully. Oh crap, this is not good. If that's the case... We could send... No, I'm, I'm sending you guys over here. You know what? Screw it. We'll go, we can go faster going this way, probably. How many divisions do they have? I'm sure they got hundreds of divisions, right? Yeah, they do. Reform our control. I don't care. Using them to bolster the war effort. 
Oh crap, please don't go to war with me. Please don't go to war with me. Please, 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 please don't go to war with me. No, 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 no. Okay, y'all need some new objectives. Please, 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 please. Go, 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 go. Alright, y'all. Y'all doing okay. But please force the attack. I'm not sure who to even ask to force the attack. Just just do it. Please, please, please. Life giver, yes, please. Anyone else have upgrades? So far, because Moctezuma is fighting different wars, we're kind of doing okay for now. But, come on, NCR, you gotta capitulate. They're taking out half of their army already. We've only killed about 57,000 of them, which is not that much, honestly. Let's grab some of this. Thank you. You guys, where are y'all? Right here. It's totally fine. Cool, 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 cool. Uh, more robots, don't mind if we do. Throw, slap them all under there. One, two, three, four. Another army leader, I guess. That's a lot of political power needed. Domino, who is an robotic expert and a mysterious stranger when we have enough command power for that. Oh my goodness, they're getting close. They're getting ready. Um, good luck. You're going to need it. This is not going to be easy. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Alright, at this point, you're taking too long. You are just taking way too long. You should be ashamed of yourselves for taking this long. No, I just want... I sucked at you. Come on, let's do this. We don't need nearly that many soldiers to do this anymore. Let's put you guys up. Boom, boom. 30 divisions are going to come over here. And how about in the center line for as long as we possibly can hold out. Hopefully do relatively okay. You guys come down here and push in for... I don't know why they're not pushing in this way, but... That would probably be very good. And then you guys come over here and actually help out right there. There you go. One gigantic mess. Yes, it is. Please push. Come on. Come on, infantry. I need you to... They yes, ask the fall of Shady Sands? Yes. Yes. A thousand times yes. But that basically does nothing. It almost does nothing. Which is really bad, but... Ace Pilot promoted. Only 43 divisions left. Come on, come on, come on. The Desert Rangers were... Oh, crap. That's not good. But they're still fighting Costa Caffinata, so that's good still. That's very good. Uh, first... Oh, God. All of Texas, too. Jesus Christ. Come on, Costa. You gotta hold out. You gotta hold out. <laughs> come on. Just kill the NCR off. Why do you take so long? They're just a bunch of, what? Democratically elected people. That's all. I can send you to Texas. You might not make it in there in time. You'll probably get encircled and die over there, too, but... Well... I guess they're gonna die trying. Humans. Guys. Infantry. Please. The way you do this is stupid. Just go. Go! <sighs> go, 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 go! How much more? How much more do we need? Why do we need so much more territory? It's literally a race against time right now. I mean, yeah, it's cool to have economic resurgence, but have you... Oh, crap. That's covered. This is not quite covered yet. Texas is completely forgotten about right now. Come on. Would you hurry your butts up? Infantry is so pathetic. Or just The army is... Come on, go, go, go. Move in. Glenville. Ooh, Glen. Glen! Shooting for the stars. Could you be any more slow? Please, just capitulate. Just capitulate. There's no way you can recover from this. Go. I'm telling you to go right there, right now. Go, 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 go. 76% of the way there. In what universe does that make any sort of sense? 70... 76? It was piercing bullet. Ooh, nice. Like, come on. The NCR is dead at this point. Look at... Just look at them. We've completely shattered all of their lines. They have nothing left. Looking good, looking good. What the hell are you guys doing? You, don't you have orders to go crazy? Yeah, they do, and they're not doing it. Like, I don't care that they don't even have orders. Give me one. Fill more. I said one, not three. Please, please, please. 
Go, 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 a thousand times, go faster. Just go in there, come on. Take the territory, take everything that they have. Oh, we're so close, we're so close. 90% of the way there, 90%. No, no, come on. We still have 93,000 manpower, which is pretty nice. Get to the god dang capital. Except you guys. We're so close. We're so close. Come on. They've... I'm good at what we really wanted to, too, but I don't think we're really in the cards for us right now. Just saying. That's good to have economic resurgences. Anyone else? Not going, even though I gave him force attack. Conquer kind of interdiction. It's fine. No one cares. Deco tactics. Ninety-seven, ninety-four percent of the way there. My God. I mean, at this point, what, what, what else are we supposed to do? Like, how can California hold on to this far? Like, if we're if we're this deep in California, this should not be happening. Like, it's over. We've almost had Redding as well. We took Redding. Are they going to give up? No, they're not. That's so much BS. Why do we need Sacra Sac Sacramento, basically? Why? We have LA, we have San Diego, we have Shady Sands, we have Redding. I, I mean, what else is there? Do we need? Why do we need that? They're they have literally nothing besides that, like Navarro. Oh, crap. That's not good. Come on. Die, for the love of God. Oh, they have no manpower. This actually might be better than what I thought. Ooh, more sand. Doki, doki. We haven't. We can't find a base at all. Okay, this is. Mm, they, they. I don't know. I want to say they, they need to get a rework, but this is pathetic. This is just beyond pathetic. We need like every major city in, in California or something. Come on, come on. Do I need to take out every tile? At this point, you must just take every province. Come on. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I, I don't want to get angry when I'm doing this or frustrated, but this is just stupid. We took out more than half of the NCR, and it's, it's still not enough. My apologies about that, but Binky wanted to leave. Let's see. Yeah, I mean, just... That's a bit too much, in my opinion. That's just too much. Regardless, though, that's going to be the end of the episode, and tomorrow will be the last episode of this campaign, because we're already over an hour long. But I hope you enjoyed it. Anyways, if you did, consider leaving a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you tomorrow when we take out pretty much the rest of the wasteland. Thanks for watching, have a great rest of your day.